Lex Kamanjiri alivalia njuga sana ya uchoraji akitumia shanga kubuni vitu mbalimbali mbali. kupitia kazi yake ya kuchora picha hizo amini usiamini ni mwaka huu ndio Kamanjiri aliweza kupata mafanikio zaidi ni taarifa ambayo niliweza kuiandaa na kwa sasa nitakuwa na kuacha ukitazama mtazamaji wetu na nitakuwa nalikunja jamvi hili la taarifa za usiku leo jina langu ni Fiona Kenga msaidizi wangu katika meza lugha ishara jina lake ni Josephine Uko mwelekezi wangu akiwa ni Duncan Rondo na mzalishaji wa taarifa hizi akiwa ni Job Maura kuwa na usiku mwema Kuwinda eneo la Karen hapa jijini Nairobi kutana na Alex Kamanjiri msanii anayetumia taaluma yake kubuni picha za watu watajika, wanyama na vitu mbalimbali mbali, tofauti na usanii wa uchoraji wa kawaida So this is how we create an art piece First of all you buy the wood and after buying the wood you make the back frame uh, this is plywood I normally use plywood and um, plywood on the back frame is made out of cypress so i buy the cypress make the back frame and then we start the artwork and we start by sketching the piece uh, and this piece is already sketched and it's already painted so the reason as to why we paint before is because the beads has holes and uh, the holes if the background is different from the image uh, it will create a different uh, effect so you have to paint the background first and uh, on a let's do a part that we've already painted uh, where do we okay let's start by this part here so you start by placing the wood glue we use wood glue because it's on plywood apply the wood the glue to the wood Make sure it does not spread. Slowly take your time. And then after that, normally I use a biro, but uh, I don't have a biro. You put the beads first. You don't just spread, but you, this is what I do first. Lakini safari yake ilianzia wapi? Three cousin lanza ikosani kijumla nilianza lini nianza nikiwa high school and then after high school nika fanya kazi hapa na pale kidogo but bado nilikuwa nafanya hii usani until 2 years ago nikaamua kuifanya fully bid specifically nilianza 2 years ago almost 2 years ago by June and uh, so far this uh, is in those lakes is my final uh, kuna zingine za ziuko hapa zingine zinshauza kama wengi kunaye anayemtazamia kwenye sanaa hii bidoc specifically niliona kazi ya ya msanii ambaye anaitwa Christine Okumu uh, kwa gallery ambayo bado na exhibit naitwa UM gallery uh, kazi yake ilikuwa ni mixture bidoc na fabric combine it on mixed media and then kwa wakati nilikuwa na chora na pencil nilikuwa na chora portraits sura za watu na pencils and then idea ika come pa mbona nisijaribu he bid na kutengeneza uso za watu m mm, nikajaribu nikaona iko sawa and vile ambavyo watu wasema the rest is history okay mimi ununua mbao tofauti tofauti mbili tofauti kwa back frame utumia kutengeneza na natumia cypress and then hapa ni plywood so plywood mimi ununua ile kubwa alafu na nazikata according to the measurements of the piece yenye nataka alafu ndo naanza kuchora yeah so cypress ina depend na urefu na bado upana wake yeah so italingana na vile unataka kununua hizi mostly ni one by one na zina kuanga 25 shillings per foot 25 to 30 depending on the place you're buying beads sasa italingana na unenunua kwa uzani mgani ama mimi ununua na pakiti so pakiti italingana na kala bado but ile cheapest na kuanga black and white currently is na kuanga 
black ni 200 per packet and then 220 white per packet but the more colors the different colors nataka different prices so kuna zile ziko higher kama brown gold those nenda 250 per packet yeah, most of the time kupitia kwa kile anachokibuni au kukiumba anapata fursa ya kueleza hisia zake za ndani kama vile furaha na huzuni yake au ya jamii kwa lugha nyepesi na ya kuvutia sana wakati mwingine lengo la kazi yake ya sanaa huwa ni kuonya kukosoa kuelimisha au kuburudisha na ananielezea kuwa sanaa inapotumika vizuri ina faida nyingi i get this moment that ni majuzi tu ni januari mwezi mpita tu ah uh, ni pato opportunity ya uh, na rafiki yangu anaitwa Chris ka kiare ali ali ni connect kwa market plan inaitwa organic farmers market wa buy niliweza kwenda huko na ku showcase artworks zangu kila weekend na ever since hizo nini nimekuwa niki make consistent sales yeah na hiyo january niliweza hata ku make more sales than days zingine ever so kuna wakati nime make ina depend kuna siku yenye una make depending on the size of the piece piece moja kubwa ikienda kuna piece and my was at 30 at 30k na kuna wakati unauza piece hizi ndogo kadhaa so zina add up to a couple of thousands bado baadhi ya changamoto ambazo umeweza kupitia katika kazi hii ni kama gani changamoto um kwa upande wa art kwa upande wa usanii ambao yeye anafanya ni watu kuikubali juu um, ile wakati naambia mtu mimi ufanya mimi ni msanii kwa wana sio most of the time mimi ni painter ama mchoraji until waone kazi yangu so bado naweza sema ile kukubalika kama msanii kwa kwa umbali tu bado itakubalika vizuri mtu mwingine ni kupata sales uh, pata wateja but for the past few months ya kuomba but kwa kianza yani hizo ni zile changamoto kila msanii upitia kupata wateja kukubalika kama msanii yeah kinaya katika safari yake ya sanaa ni kuwa imepigwa jeki na kukubaliwa na wateja asio wajua kando na familia na marafiki lakini hilo halijamzuia kufuata azma yake ya kuwa msanii mtajika katika sanaa hii ya kipekee. If there's anything you can do, do it. Yeah, usi ukika hapo tu uh, chakula itatoka juu. Lazima ufanye kitu. Hata mingi kwambia mimi ni msanii na sina kazi. Hauta 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 kubali mimi ni msanii until wana kazi yangu. Nishafanya part yangu. So part yenye na na dasemaji patio ingine ni mm. msemo yana kuja kununua si ndio ama kuji market so do your part if it's art tengeneza art yako if it's marketing your art market na mtazamaji ukitaka kuinua biashara yake kama njiri if you're willing to support and uh, you love my work nazani pata kwa instagram alex almi alex a double l m i alex alafu a double l m i number simo uh, 07 currently pieces zangu ziko kwa gallery ambayo inaitwa um gallery um gallery iko waterfront mall mm, first floor kwa miaka sita alex kamanjiri amekuwa akitumia ubunifu wake kuunda kazi kama hizi ambazo zimekuwa zikimpa riski ya kila uchao Fiona Kenga nikiripotia runinga ya Lookup eneo la kuwinda Karen jijini Nairobi